Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf, your one only, and welcome back to some more King of Fighters All Stars. So, yeah, I have actually been enjoying this game quite a bit. I played a lot of it on stream for like, I want to say, two hours before it kept crashing for me. At least on this simulator. But I think I made a few changes to where it's gonna work with me. But yeah, I mostly just tried to finish all these so I don't have to go back and do all this crap again. But I've also learned that you have to go pretty deep into story to unlock other places. Like, it's not like beat one place and this unlocks. You literally have to go, like, pretty far into story just to unlock all the other experts and stuff like that. And, well, I actually just unlocked this. Okay. And plus there is co-op in the game, which is... Which I found to be very weird, to be honest. Because I was like, wow, there's actual co-op in here. And clearly you can pick whichever one's closer to you and stuff like that. Um, I was say, I'll probably have to go EU, because EU just seems the most populated for like games. I think the whole gamer thing is to go to EU. <laughs> no rooms created. Alright, we're going to EU. We're America 2. Okay, sure, let's try that. Uh, yeah, no rooms there. EU it is. There's always a room in EU. Or something like that. Okay. No rooms available. Alright. Well, <laughs> I tried. I mean, I can always create a room, I guess. And make it public. I think it's because people never make it public. I think that's what it is. And plus, if you sit in here too long without the match starting and everybody's ready, apparently it shuts... It basically ends the server. So if somebody's read it up, you have to just start the game. Which is kind of dumb to me. It's really dumb. I wish they did not have that because you know you never know if you want like a full room. But the game says, oh, one person just joined you. You got two people. That guy's ready to up. He's ready to go. All right, let's just start the game. That I learned is like really, really annoying. And I don't like that, like that function at all. I hope they change it, or at least give me a long countdown somewhere over here. I would say put down a counter right here that at least gives me like let's say three minutes max would be the perfect time before anybody joins or at least have I guess preserve no just take in one person I guess so you're just gonna carry in more person you know just like I'm gonna have a max of three people or I prefer a max of three people then start counting down or I prefer a max of two people, then start counting down. But you know, three people would be nice, but you know, I put on two people. Something like that. But I've learned that not many people do co-op. I guess you would mostly want to do it with like friends and stuff. I tried it on stream, I got in like one person, then he was already readied up, then it just canceled. Yeah, that's literally co-op. <laughs> Or I, or I just do these solo, to be honest. I mean, as long as you have characters doing the work, you're pretty much good. But I've learned the characters that I actually want in this game. Uh, Kim is definitely staying in my party. Just because he has so many lifts. And so many ground hits, too. That's one of them. That's another one. I've literally just been playing the hell out of Kim. I haven't changed to anybody else, really. Kind of hard to hit these guys with a bigger map. But you gotta, like, go everywhere. A 
just say, is anybody gonna hit him? <laughs> so you got a little countdown timer at the top left. Like, this starts to get way harder. But Geese is definitely another character I want. So I might save up, like, uh, coins. Not coins, uh, rubies. Let's go to the index, because I cannot pronounce the uh, other guy's name. I know uh, Geese is dark, and he's right... Yeah, here. Nice try. I love his movesets and the way he fights. It's like really amazing to me. I tried him out in a little time attack, which is actually pretty useful. And then there is... where is he? I know he's a purple unit. Oh, there he is. This character. I like his movesets as well. And he's pretty much a badass, that's for sure. He has, like, a really annoying attack to where he will... No, wait, let's go to the preview. I was just acting up. To where he'll throw up this wind on an enemy. Not only that, you can grab a person within that wind and still have the extra damage going up. Like, this guy just is amazing. <laughs> you see what I mean by badass, dude? Now I took a look at Yuri. Well, Onigiri, Onigirchi, or whatever the hell it's called. Where is it? There it is. I'm disappointed. <laughs> I mean, I. I'm happy at one hand, but I'm also disappointed. Because there was a way cooler animation for his uh, max finisher. That when he did this... Yeah. I'm happy with the voice acting. I'm happy with the stats, I'm happy with the way he fights. I'm just upset about his max, like, special, or finisher. Just because there was a way more cooler animations of him doing that attack. To where each time he hit, it would, like, do a black screen. And his body would turn into a red portrait. Every time he hit, it started ripping at the opponent, it would start going red too. And every time he would hit down with his both his fists, it would turn red. Like, I'm sad that they didn't do that one out of everything. But yeah. I'm happy they added him in. I love his voice. I'm just not a huge fan of Leona, to be honest. Her voice is kind of weird. Her animations are kind of cringy, cringy too. Listen, well, no, not listen. Watch. Uh, not that one. I think it's her finisher. Watch the animations. No, no, not that one. I think it was this. That. <laughs> Everything else was cool. Why did... Why did she have to do it in that stance? <laughs> like, that... That's the one stance that threw me off. I was just sitting here like... Okay. That's actually pretty badass. Did it get to the end? I'm just in here like, oh. Okay. <laughs> like, everything else moveset-wise is actually pretty cool, but... Eh. 
It's not a character I would personally aim for. I'll probably aim for Orochi. But yeah, overall, that's pretty much the characters I'm aiming for. It's just Geese and um, this guy. But Geese more, of anything. I mean, Vice is actually pretty good too. From what I thought of her, she's really annoying and does a lot of damage for no reason. And her grabs are insane. Space is like, yeah, good luck. I think this is the one I've been fighting most of the time in PvP. And it's this grab here that does so much damage to me, I'm pretty sure. No, up, oh, yeah, never mind. Yes, it is. <laughs> I haven't seen her uh, specials. Ah, uh, yep. I've been hit by that plenty of times. Yeah, I'm just overall enjoying this game, to be honest. I played a lot of it on stream and might keep playing a lot more. So don't be surprised if I upload a lot of videos of the game. <laughs> I'm still going through story, trying to get all my other difficulties unlocked so I can start farming higher. Which I know I can farm higher with these characters. It's just that story takes forever to get past. Just because you gotta do everything perfect, you gotta summon characters, gotta do all that. Ah. <sighs> And also, you need car hello. You need special cards for the like final um, finisher. Come on, get up. You know what? Kim would just finish you off. The most fun part is when you could do like a full combo with your character skills. You could just switch and continue the combo. If you can find characters like that that work really well together, where you can just use all of their skills in just like one go, that'd be perfect. Yeah, I like that. And yeah, that's why you don't use Kim's ability early. But yeah, you gotta see what I mean. I could have went into my finisher there. Nope, not like that. But yeah. Kim would definitely be my favorite. Now I gotta beat him with yellow elements and stuff like that later on. I just stopped focusing on that and just started going through. That's like something I'll come back to once I finish all my other stuff and farmings. I started leveling up characters and evolving them. I was like, I could probably do like one summon for you guys and that's basically it. I mean, I would like K, to be honest. But that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about in this video, man. And show off my progress. Oh, if it's a red, who is it though? I'd be happy if it's K. Uh, first one, too. Sounds... Oh. It's you. Eh. I was say, if you can give me, like, a four-star geese, I'll be happy. <laughs> I guess all these are shards. Well, most of them are shards. But yeah, here are all my characters so far. I recently just got him yesterday. So you're gonna do blue. There's so many variations of you that's just insane. I have not used any Terry's yet. At least not yet. 
mostly just need to get the resources to evolve them. Because I don't want to use four stars right now. Variations. So that's why I'm trying to get him up to five star. I know... Jesus Christ, this character is like really strong in PvP. Like, she's destroyed like half of my team with how much like frame she has. Like, if you have her, use her. <laughs> There's no point not to. This guy is pretty damn strong. Uh, not that variation, though. Um, uh, where is the other variation that was pretty that strong was that I was there. using? Huh? Is, is the spin kick not there? No, it's not you. I guess I don't have that variation. That I know of. Unless this is him. No. I don't have that variation. But yeah. One of his variations has like a little spin kick to it. To where he spins around in circles, dealing damage over it as long as you're in it. That one I enjoy a lot. I haven't used King yet. And if anybody knows any boxing characters in the game, let me know. Because <laughs> I would love to use like some real fast paced boxing characters. I might use him. Imagine being kicked like that in real life. I gotta say, the animation quality is amazing too. And now you're gonna see Street Fighter making a game like this and all kinds of other fighting games. Now Mortal Kombat's gonna make one. <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> I don't need more games added to my list, alright? I really don't. But yeah, my allergies are acting up, guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and end it off here and go take some allergy medicine. Hope you guys enjoyed. Until then, I have not been in here. Oh, these are for shards and stuff like that. Cars, you have to be ranked 20. Ah, oh, okay, I guess that's cool. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys on the next one. Until then, peace out.